Hello students. Today we're doing our clarified butter demo. You remember on Tuesday we discussed the properties of butter. You remember it's 80% fat. What's the rest of it? That's right, 20% milk, solids, and water. What we need to do is we're going to clarify a half pound of butter. Let's take a look. We have a half pound of butter here. Mm -hmm. We've got it started here. What we don't want to do is brown any of these milk solids, so don't melt it too quickly. But once it melts, because it still has water in it, it's going to boil, and that's what we want to do. We want to boil out the water, and the milk solids will separate from the fat. At this point, just melted, almost completely melted. It is now completely melted. And it's boiling pretty good. I'm gonna reduce the heat just slightly. Oh, I'm really high. Now, you've cooked sugar before. When uh, you cook sugar and water, like you're going to make a caramel or a candy, once all the water has boiled out, You'll see that the sugar at that point, which is a syrup, it has like a different bubble to it. You'll notice water has like a, a little more quiet sound as it bubbles, as it boils. <laughs> and sugar um, has definitely a, a little more bubbly sound as it boils. There's less and less sugar, excuse me, <laughs> there's less and less water in here. So as soon as there starts to be even a trace of caramelization, that means there's no water left. And I could turn the heat down or even off because the temperature of the butter will start to rise from 212. If you did have a laser thermometer, I don't know if you can notice, but at this point, it is actually the same temperature, but it's not boiling because there is no water left in the, in the uh, fat. At this point, if you let it go anymore, it's going to caramelize. So what you can do is turn off your heat and let it 